MP3s are a difference in quality. Um, does it bother me? Yeah, it bothers me to my core. Um, do I know how narrow that is? Yes. Um, do I remember how prevalent cassettes were and how people put up with those? Yeah. So, you know, the MP3 is the equivalent of a cassette. Uh, it's been long been known that people are very happy with the copy and not necessarily tied into the quality. So it is mobility and more than anything, it's how many numbers can we store? You know, it's just a, there's a real limit to how big the data can be in terms of, of quality. So we're always going to see, have that battle in the, now in the digital age. Um, so I think, th I think the issue of quality is really a, a little squirrely. I was just having a conversation this morning um, with someone about a band recently uh, rele uh, put a release out and essentially made it a la carte, pay what you want. Uh, and uh, it's now coming out that the, f the free version, quote unquote free version, has a lesser quality and now people are reacting to that, which I see as a pretty positive sign because there hasn't been any occasion before now that people were concerned about quality. So I see that as a pretty positive. Um, I would think that uh, people who are dealing with surround and wanting to deliver f f files in 96K uh, uh, bit depth uh, uh, sampling rate uh, are encouraged by that. But I think it's always going to be a small part of the market. It's like the audiophile segment of the market.